up Rav Leos, welcome back to my channel. Today we are at Providence. That's the Ramada Hotel. That's the overpass here for Providence. And we're here to check out this new Starbucks. The new Starbucks uh, fast food joint at the Amazonia Mall. Now this is the entrance to the mall. I think this used to be called Red Road. Right, that's the East Bank Road. And to get into the mall, you need to turn left into this road that runs beside the Ramada Hotel, the Ramada um, Hotel and Casino, Princess Casino, which is over there on the left. And on the right hand side, you have all of these vendors selling produce, fruits and vegetables, clothing, trinket, trinkets and stuff. So to get to this mall, the Amazonia Mall, you need to walk in a little bit, maybe a hundred meters in from the East Bank Road. It's been raining a little bit and you can see this sidewalk not very good but the only thing separating us from these puddles and the traffic on the road. But let me tell you a little bit about this Amazonia Mall. The Amazonia Mall was built by Sarwan which is a Guyanese cricketer. Right next door is the stadium that is the Providence Cricket Stadium. This Amazonia Mall was built by a cricketer, Ramesh Sarwan, and it's a little bit like the story of Magic Johnson. So a lot of these sports uh, personalities made a lot of money during their sports career and then invested that money like Magic Johnson invested in theaters, various theaters in Los Angeles and in New York, Brooklyn, the Bronx and Harlem and so on, Manhattan. But this guy in his cricketer, Ramesh Sarwan, invested his earnings in this shopping plaza this mall and we called it Amazonia Mall. So we're going to check out this Amazonia Mall and the new Starbucks. So immediately you can see that Starbucks. This has been open for about 48 hours, about two days now. Well, I think this is the second day or the third day that it's open. And there's still a fair amount of construction going on here at the mall. This is the mall parking lot. I'm not even certain if this is the correct entrance but there seems to be some expansion work going on here in the parking lot and some construction. But this is the Amazonia Mall guys. So we're gonna check out the Starbucks um, fast food joint, restaurant, coffee, coffee house and the Amazonia Mall. Now malls are actually going out of style, going out of business. This of course used to be big business in the 1990s, you know, but now the malls in North America are closing because of online shopping. And so building malls is something that might not last very long. Right now it's a novelty in Guyana. It's still novelty in Guyana, but as you can imagine, yeah, this is the drive-thru for Starbucks. Starbucks drive-thru. Yeah, building malls here is still novelty because, of course, Guyana is only now um, expanding. The economy is only now expanding because of the uh, 
because of the oil and gas industry, right, influx of capital, and this is where the money is being spent to build these hardware stores, basically um, brick and mortar stores. But of course, online shopping is where it's at. Go check out my online stores. I have two of them that are operational right now. RN brand online, where I have my Raffle Nation brand and Olivia dot on iron brand online where I have chocolates cheese wine and snacks but this is the Amazonian mall so you can see there's dairy cream there's flame so this Brewster's quality Burger King Jade's Walk Pizza Hut KFC and so on so that wing that section of the wall I guess is dedicated to food and fast food and on this side we have I guess shopping we're gonna check out the um, we're gonna check out the Starbucks in a sec but just wanted to show you the layout of the mall Amazonia mall here at Providence this is Ramesh Sarwan's mall there's Riaz Computers on the left, just past the entrance, and the other side. Gabriella, I suppose. So I guess these are the anchor stores, and of course, in between there are this Urban Life, Unique Innovations, and so on. So, and the kiosks, of course, uh, some phone phone stores some souvenir stores kiosks it's a photo booth it's Brewster's this Riaz computer the food shakes all right that's what you have in this sign section of the mall here at the Amazonia mall there is Sukrat Jewelry, so there's a jewelry store, Indian Fashions, there's Sparkle, there's a laundromat, there's Ashuria, they have a kiosk here, restrooms. Ashuria, of course, is the insurance company. There's Fab Fashions, there's Tashman's. Mandy's the City Williams Technologies Strinas, I suppose that's also a go ahead clothing store this mad tea which is also a um, food joint Thea's World another food joint the Stuart Dental I guess this is Dental Clinic over here and of course there are the restrooms and that's about half of it I suppose eventually we're gonna make our way over to the To the new Starbucks but just showing you what's happening here there's Sukraj jewelry Stnet or Enet Enet I suppose is a new phone store see the other half of this section of the mall there is Optique which is I guess an eyewear store and of course some kiosks in the middle. This is uh, cosmetics, I suppose. Another phone kiosk. And some trinkets. There's a fashion boutique and a lingerie shop. And 
another kiosk. Gabriella's, I suppose that's another cosmetic store. This Toto's, which is, I suppose, a luggage shop. In the end, so, so that's what's happening here, guys. That's, that's the bulk of it by any um, by comparison by any comparison I suppose to some of the malls I suppose it would be considered like half of one of the floors on in a mall let's say for comparison I would say it's equivalent in size to the mall in Mississauga which one actually it's about a quarter of the size of square one uh, it's about I know it's a it's a tiny tiny mall by comp by North American standards but I suppose in Guyana it's considered mean I don't know if there's a second floor we'll check it out in a minute if there is but that's that's online shopping zoom is here yes there is a second floor I'll take it up this is the elevator to the second floor so a lot of floors on the ground a lot of stores on the ground floor are these tiny shops but I suppose there'd be the anchor stores this I suppose the home store is like their anchor store here on the second floor all right the anchor store is usually one of four major retailers usually four major retailers in a decent sized mall this I suppose is the Caribbean cinemas the theater so they'd have several screens I suppose and of course in a wing that is cut off from this section of the mall there's all of those food joints all right so that's it guys that's what's happening here that's what's happening here at the Mall of Providence Amazonia Mall there's just one anchor store I suppose that's the home store and and these are the these are the food food joints the restaurants right the ones you can see from this distance with outdoor dining and the ones you can see at the top that's about it guys that's about it this Payless it's a shoe store Payless brand shoes I don't know if you can consider that an anchor store but they do have an outlet here this Lee's fashion on la Lazy's fusion Lazy's fusion Let's see if you can take a quick look around up there and see oh there is I guess a little bit more of dining so there's KFC there's a KFC drive through right the KFC drive through on this side from this vantage point you can see the parking lot that's the parking lot in the mall that's a little construction that they're building additional I guess extension to the mall and the other side beyond this is the Providence Stadium All right out there is the road the East Bank Road and over here that's the Ramada Ramada Hotel and we're back in the mall so this is the Amazonia mall it's actually quite tiny Lazy's Fusion I suppose is a restaurant this is rest resto bar it's also a food joint there is 
Ramesh Sarwan. So, like I said, the mall was built by this cricketer, Ramesh Sarwan. And like I said, I compare him to uh, Magic Johnson. You know, Magic built some theaters in Harlem and Brooklyn. That's Mr. Ramesh Sarwan, famous Guyanese cricketer. And the mall was built by him. Ramesh Sarwan, that's the mall, guys. That's the mall, you see the Caribbean cinemas. And I said, come please. Is there a downstairs? You can go downstairs from here? Yeah, yeah, you can go downstairs. You get rid of it. Okay, thanks. So that is it, guys. That is the extent of the mall here at Providence, Amazonia Mall, built by Ramesh Sarwan, the Guyanese cricketer. And like I said, I would compare it to Magic Johnson theaters and the Magic Johnson business enterprise in LA and New York. Bad Monkey Merch is a merchandise store. Actually, there's an entrance here to the section of the mall we came from. Right, so we came out of this section before. But this here is the food section of the mall. So that's it, guys. Tell me what you think about Amazonia Mall here. That's a brief tour. I'm gonna take a look at the Starbucks, the new Starbucks. Um, fast food joint but that is it that is the Amazonia mall here at Providence a brief tour of the Amazonia mall want to see more content like this click like and subscribe share this video with friends and family around the world tell me what you think about Amazonia mall built by Ramesh Sarwan here in Providence in Guyana share this video with friends and family around the world let people know what's happening here in Guyana Later!